Okay, so I woke up this morning feeling absolutely dead inside and I thought I would just start like microdosing nostalgia as you do and I was thinking about all the TV shows that I used to watch growing up and I was like oh my god I totally forgot about these shows so that maybe I'd share with the class um so these are TV shows for millennials that you didn't remember that you remembered copyright pending okay first up we have uh brace face this is on a show formerly known as fox family I have no idea what it's called now this show is literally about a girl who was like in middle school and she had braces absolutely riveting um I, and as someone who had a mouthful of metal as a middle schooler this this sh was incredible to me this i followed this like it was the bible um the scene where she gets her braces taken off was like seared into my cerebellum i was like that will be me one day absolutely incredible um also banger theme song breast face my life is complicated, boyfriends. Don't want to talk about a teenage. I will get out in the end. Face, face. Absolute banger. Bob City population of one. Great show. This one. And I cannot stress this enough. Disney Channel, so weird. Lived for this show. This show was my goosebumps. I didn't watch Goosebumps. This was my goosebumps. And it scared the ever living sh out of me okay essentially it was about this girl who was her mom was a rock star and they were traveling across the country going to different shows but she could like see the paranormal she was like in touch with the paranormal so every episode was like her saving the world from like ghosts or vampires or whatever the f literally this show walked so that supernatural could run you can't tell me any different um obviously starring our favorite brink right there um mackenzie phillips who has a wild story go look it up this show is so good and you know i'm gonna say it incredible theme song i'm not gonna sing it just go look it up great show Okay, anyone who knows me at all knows this is insanely off-brand for me, but Rocket Power. Nickelodeon's Rocket Power lived for this show. It was essentially about these four friends who just like rollerbladed and surfed in what I assume is like Venice, LA. And it was incredible. I, I thought they were the coolest kids. And like this chick wanted to be her. Wanted to be her. Put morph me into her body, okay? Between this and Brink, I was like, should I rollerblade? Is are all the cool kids rollerblading? I have flat feet, so that dream died very quickly. But, and you know I'm going to say it. You know I'm going to say it. Banger theme song. We are riders on a mission. Action kids in play position. Rocket power. Oh, this whole thing is just missing f***ing theme songs. Whatever. This is a great show. Okay, so this is a deep, deep, deep cut. But if you know this, you f***ing know this. Caitlin's Way, this is on Nickelodeon. I lived for this show, okay? So this is about, this is Caitlin, hi. Um, she was like a punk rock emo bad girl in the city and she gets like arrested and the judge is like, you have to go live with your family and bump fuck Montana and then chaos ensues because she's a city girl, does drugs. I, I don't know how to explain it besides she is my Billie Eilish. She is my Alanis Morissette. I will forever bend the knee to her throne. I fucking love this show. She falls in love with the horse boy. It's an incredible plot. Also, great theme song. <laughs> 